Hi, this is Sean with OMU Energy, and today we're going to show you and talk a bit about the Rivian R1T. This truck is actually equipped with two of our uh, lithium iron phosphate batteries, and we put those in here because they increase the longevity of the 12 volt battery system, the reliability of it, which is great when you're doing things like off-roading and you're adventuring and you wanna make sure you don't lose a 12 volt battery just because it gets decayed and weak because it's a lead acid battery like these come with from the factory. Um, you also shed some pounds, so that's not a huge deal on such a heavy truck anyways. Uh, so yeah, these are these are great. Um, wonderful addition to your, to your Rivian. Uh, they're for the R1T or the R1S. And what we're gonna do today is actually take this truck off-roading a little bit. Um, I've been driving the, the R1T myself for something like maybe 7,500 miles over the last few months since we got ours. Love it, um, they're great trucks. Uh, some, some pros and cons over the other EVs out there, so we'll, we'll touch a little bit on those things and uh, give you a, just like general feedback on the truck and then, and then show you a little bit about uh, how it does off-road as well. All right, so we just got to the trailhead where we're gonna do a little off-roading. Um, we're in sport, so first thing you want to do, of course, is go to off-road. Um, we'll start out in just all-terrain, and we're going to go to the highest suspension settings. So now the truck will lift itself up like six inches, which is awesome, so you get really good ground clearance. So let's say we're gonna try out camp mode. Um, we didn't find the most level spot possible. We tried to get one that's a little off kilter just to, just to see how well it does. But you just tap the camp icon, which if it wasn't there, you would tap here, go to camping. And then you've got all these cool camp mode things and we're gonna do level truck and see how it does. Oh, it did a pretty good job. So some of the really neat stuff about this truck, uh, of course, all the storage capacity. You look at a pickup truck and you can imagine, oh, you've got the truck bed to store things, and that's great. But with this, you not just have the truck bed, you also have the gear tunnel, which is an awesome long space for things like snowboards or skis. I mean, it's just a very long uh, storage space that's easily accessible. And really cool, of course, the flaps come down and or the doors come down, and you've got two great places to sit. Uh, and then you've got a huge frunk as well for storage. So you add those in there and you just have like a ton of storage. So gear um, for, for whatever you like to do, whatever adventures you like to go on, you can you can just take everything with you. It's not it's not a real problem or challenge. Uh, the, the, the ride height settings are very, very cool too. When you're highway driving and it's, it's sitting nice and low, very efficient, uh, least aerodynamic drag, 
then you go off road and you can you can you can put it in the highest setting of course and you see in the video like that that giant difference between low and and highest settings um, so you can really really tackle some rocks and not worry about scratching the bottom side of the the truck of course where that that battery pack is uh, and like this one had we've got that reinforced um, uh, shield the off-roading shield so that helps too and then the camp mode I mean that is that's phenomenal like the you saw how this we were on a hill very very tilted and it would be a it'd be a crap experience if you tried to camp like that because you, your head would be either way down or way up uh, and maybe you like that and and that would work but but putting it into camp mode I mean it took a little while for the compressor to get there but but once it got it level it was very very good we were very spot on level um, and that was a fairly aggressive spot as far as camping goes. The only downside that we've seen so far in, in, in kind of using this a lot is the, the compressor when you really like, when you do this kind of adventure stuff, doesn't seem like it keeps up well. Um, and we're in this, in this video, we're kind of abusing it a little bit. We're, we're, we're putting it to its limits and we're, and we're doing it a few times each time. Uh, but it takes a while to move up and down and the compressor tends to overheat after after trying to do it one full cycle and, and then trying to do a second full cycle quickly thereafter uh we're finding that it's it's overheating a lot um and so then the compressor just times out and then then you've just got to wait and give it a lot of time um so we'll wrap it up there this is a really great vehicle we're really happy about having it uh we're really happy about bringing our lithium batteries to these as omu um or that's kind of the whole the whole point of all this um we love these trucks they're they're great but mostly I mean, we're just really all about electric vehicles and providing a really really good better 12 volt battery solution for every electric vehicle out there we started with the teslas when I mean, they were the main the main ev forever uh but now there's just so much cool stuff coming onto the market and we're just really excited to have batteries ready and available for all these different platforms uh, we just launched our app recently which which is really cool and you can pick that up in, in the Google uh, Play Store or the Apple Store um, and that gives you insight to your battery if it's a Bluetooth enabled battery most of the batteries I mean, all the batteries we've sold so far that are not Bluetooth enabled but all, all the batteries that we're going to be starting into manufacturing in the future we're going to start pushing everything into into Bluetooth and so I'll be compatible with our app so you get really good insight for your, your battery that way so you just know if it's healthy or not is the main thing but it's 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 really cool because you can you can monitor your battery better and then um, you can you can do resets if you need if you need to or if you just want to power your car totally off with Without actually disconnecting the battery for like a storage mode you can go ahead and you can actually disable your batteries from, from the app which is cool so check us out we're at omu.com o-h-m-m-u um, rivians are awesome as a summary to this whole thing they do very well off-roading I'm not an extreme off-roader but for for the kind of stuff that I could that I, I could ever imagine myself doing this truck is more than capable and and very very good at it so um, yeah, much love for the Rivians. Take care and enjoy your vehicles.